Hello, good morning guys. Um, this is Jolt and um, I would like to answer a question some of my friends took to me before and they asked me if we can see how many friends unfriended us or how many new friends were created and we should identify these people who they were. This is actually quite a simple task we can do. So if we go on our Facebook profile and then <clears throat> we um, click on our name here and then we click on our friends right then here we have a friends list so we can see our friends and right here we have to right click on the mouse and then uh, I have here a Hungarian um, you know descriptions but don't worry about that there is a save as uh, button so you have to click on the save as and then you have to choose the format mhtml and give the file a name so I gave a name and then I will save it into the documents folder. So I click on save and um, once this is saved I just have to open it. So once I open it then you can see a list here and then um, you know when you see this list basically you created an MHTML format. So once this is created this MHTML format then you can right click you can first of all you have to uh, press the Ctrl A button and with the Ctrl A you select everything. After the Ctrl A you press the Ctrl C button so that you can copy everything or what you can do you right click and then you uh, click on copy. So after you clicked on copy you have to open a notepad plus plus and in a notepad plus plus <coughs> basically what we do is first we clear all compares so we don't have uh, compares here and we open a new tab. And basically we will, with the control V, we will put all the friends into this Notepad++. And then we can save it. And let's say one week later we see in our Facebook profile that some of our friends are missing, like uh, three, four friends are missing, and we would like to, to know who these people were. So then we have to um, repeat the steps that I show you uh, one week later, and then after that you have to repeat that step that you you know save it into into that format I showed you before and then you come back to the notepad plus plus you open a new tab and you will uh, paste the friends one week later so let's illustrate this here so we had this first let's say one week later um, this friend for example is missing from my friends list so what I can do I will copy over everything from here just for illustration but you you don't have to do that because you will uh, you know just um, <clears throat> save it into a new HTML format one week later so you will have this list and let's say here I will just uh, take away this guy um, who is um, Eon so I like him also I don't want to delete him just uh, for the sake of this exercise and now I want to compare this one and this one because this includes uh, the content a week ago and this includes the content right now so I will stand uh, on this one on this tab and I will choose uh, this uh, menu which is in Hungarian unfortunately so in English it's called plugin so I, I have to um, click on the compare and then I will compare and then you see Eon is missing so probably he is gone, he deleted me, or probably he, he uh, seized his profile, so we don't know what happened to him, but we see immediately who is missing. So the same thing will happen if we have a new friend, let's say, and then um, I will clear all compares. Let's say in the new list we have a new friend, let's say John Bull, okay? So and let's say he has one mutual friend. So my next list we show that uh, John Bull is there but he was not there in my former list so I want to make compare again so I click on plugins and then I will click on compare and right here I will see that Eon is missing so a week ago Eon was still there is not there anymore and then I have a new friend um, during the last week so John became one of my new friends and then I can see who is there I hope this uh, short video helped you guys and you understand how you can compare your Facebook friends, how you can see that. Thank you very much and uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.